Commuter Rail Transit is a rail transit system shared with freight train tracks and typically has uh, hubs of probably about five miles apart. So we have typically uh, less stops than some other rail modes and buses, but higher speeds and uh, frequencies a little less, but um, it uh, typically serves communities, uh, uh, suburbs that, that feed a, a major metropolitan area. One advantage is commuter rail transit is an additional capacity in the region for transit. So in addition to the existing highway grid, there becomes utilization of the resource of a rail bed for moving people or as a transit mode. So that's, that's one uh, advantage. Another advantage is commuter rail typically has a very high reliability. Uh, commuter rail is, at least where I am, about a 97% on-time performance. So it's not subject to a lot of the uh, issues of the congestion of the rail, uh, the road network. Some people think commuter rail, well, it's on a rail bed with locomotives. It must be really uh, a lot of pollution, which really is not the case, actually. Um, with the existing technology, the emissions uh, for uh, rail can be very, very low. And uh, so that would be, that would maybe be one myth. Um, another myth is, well, trains are really, really noisy. And um, again, the, the equipment isn't exactly like it was years ago. And uh, it is less noisy than it was. And there's even uh, ways to minimize noise going through communities if communities choose that. Commuter rail transit really in, the, in this country for the last 20 years has become quite popular, especially here in the West where we don't have the traditional infrastructure of subways and a lot of the, um, the old rail systems. So um, on the West Coast, uh, there's a number of cities and now increasingly even in the, in the Midwest, a lot of metropolitan areas are choosing uh, to have uh, commuter rail transit because it offers capacity where a metropolitan area has been growing uh, and outgrowing their roadway grid. CRT has been a proven and successful means of moving lots of people, uh, especially in, in the commuting hours. So it's a, a great alternative to the existing highway system to be able to bring people to work in a reliable and timely fashion.